went today. I'm sure you could tell from the expression on my face how this parole hearing went today. They denied my son parole after five years of serving his time. No trouble. No trouble whatsoever. He has done five years. They denied my son parole and won't consider parole again until another five years. That's a total of 10 years that's being taken away from my son. My son has never gotten in trouble the whole time he has gotten in prison. He has obtained his high school diploma. He has never... This is, um, this is beyond me. This is beyond me. Anybody that knows how I feel about my kids know how this is affected me right now. But I will say this. I will say this. That if you got family, you got family that's going through Alabama Department of Corrections, pray for your family. Pray for your family because they are making an example out of everybody. Everybody. Everybody today so far that has went up for parole has gotten denied. They have gotten denied. And it's like now I'm beginning to think it's all about money. These folks get paid money to hold these people in prison. They get paid money. This is a money thing for Alabama. Right now, Alabama is broke as fuck. And they making an example out of the ones. And this is this is modern day slavery. Modern day slavery. They making an example out of everybody. That's in Alabama Department of Corrections right now. You may have 2% of people that go up for parole that actually will get parole. The other 98% are getting denied. My baby, my baby has gotten denied. And I just knew that he was going to be coming home. They won't consider parole again for another five years. That's another, that's 10 years that's taken from my son for a mistake that he made as a child, as a child. And I'm at a loss for words like, this really seems unreal. I need all, all of my prayer warriors right now to pray for me pray for my family pray for my son I know how I feel right now I could just imagine how he feels keep us in your prayers keep it coming cause lord everybody that knows me knows how I feel about my kids this is like somebody just stabbed me in my stomach over and over again. This is so painful. So painful. So painful. I really thought my child was coming home. But Alabama Department of Corrections showed me that they don't give two fucks about none of our family, about nothing. <laughs>